Puff Fu Power. In Farmer Yumi's barn, the Paw Patrol pups, Mayor Goodway and Chicoletta, practiced their Puff Fu moves. Rubble flew through the air and kicked a board in half. Strong kick, Rubble, Ryder cheered. Thanks, Ryder, Rubble said. The pups have been working very hard, Farmer Yumi told Ryder. They're ready to test for their yellow belts. Mayor Goodway's not so sure, is she? Oh my. Certainly. Students begin, Farmer Yumi said to the Paw Patrol. The pups bowed to their teacher and showed off their moves one by one. Arf, arf. Marshall barked as he spun on his tail, holding his paws out ready for action. Rocky used the grabber in his backpack to hold a staff. He trilled it and planted it on the floor of the barn and vaulted over it. Arf, ha! Rocky cried as he struck a martial arts position. He looks very strong. Sky stood still for a moment, then flipped high into the air. As she turned a somersault, she kicked out in both directions. She landed on all fours. Yip, yip, ha! Sky yelped as she kicked her paw straight out. Zuma raised himself up on his back paws and held his front paws out. He moved slowly and smoothly to the left. Then he moves slowly and smoothly to the right. Ah, oh, he's good. He is good. Zuma was in complete control and ready for action. On the floor, Rubble rolled to his left and kicked with his back leg. He ya! He rolled to his right and kicked with his other back leg. He ya! Finally, Rubble kicked with both legs. He ya! Chase announced, and now I will. Uh, uh, choo! Farmer Yumi looked concerned. Sorry, Chase explain, explained. I'm a little, little blah, blah, blah. I'm a little allergic to kittens. He noticed a kitten standing next to him. Ha, ha, choo! Chase sneezed so hard, his headband flew off and landed on his nose. Mayor Humdinger walked into the walked into the barn with the rest of his catastrophe crew. My kittens will be will get their yellow belts before the Paw Patrol, he bragged, because their kajitsu is better than Puffu. It's not about which art is superior, Mayor Goodway said. The point is for all pups, kittens, mares, and chickens to do their best. Show them kittens, Mayor Humdinger said, clapping his hands. The catastrophe crew lined up. One by one, the kittens sprang into action. They jumped, they kicked, they twirled. They even balanced on a ball of yarn. High in the rafters of the barn, one kitten set up a cable to slide down. Marshall got there before the kitten. I'll show you how a pup food master uses a zip line, he said. He jumped up, grabbed the cord, and slid down it. Whee! But when Marshall was halfway down, the kitten used its mechanical claw to tug on a zip line. The line shook, and Marshall went flying. Whoa! Thump! Marshall fell to the barn floor. Are you okay? Rubble asked. Sure. Marshall answered, a pup boom master always knows exactly how to land when he accidentally falls. Next, we will have the sparring part of our yellow belt test, Farmer Yumi said. Begin. The pups and kittens began to spar. Marshall sprang over a kitten, then jumped back the other way, turning a somersault in midair. The kitten launched a ball of yarn from her backpack, aiming it right at Marshall. Whoa! He yelled as he fell to the floor. His legs were tangled in the yarn. Pup foo! Mayor Hundinger snickered. That looks more like a pup fail. Farmer Yumi gave each pup a yellow belt. Your extra hard work would please the ancient master, she said. But there were no belts for the kittens. Mayor Humdinger, Farmer Yumi said, until your kittens learn to control themselves and their tools, I'm afraid they cannot earn their yellow belts. Aw, oh, Pooey. Is that what he says? <laughs> Hooray for the Paw Patrol, Ryder cheered. They were all good pups, and they were all very good sports. I think they're going, 